turn that down so you can hear me better. I'm not going to be able to look very much because I am going to drive and talk to you because something happened. Hello, who's ever coming in? Good morning, good morning. I know I shouldn't be driving and talking to you, but I know, right? I should have stayed in bed. <laughs> this is what I should have stayed in bed this morning. I'll have to see who's talking in a second because I can't see. Oh, 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 oh. We're going to make this work or else I'm going to have to pull over and talk to you. Okay, let me pull over and talk to you, and then I'll drive, and then I'll talk to you some more later. So let me tell you what happened. Here I am, I'll pull over. Okay, so here's what happened. Hello, everybody that came in that I missed. Okay, so got up to go to garage sales this morning. Uh, my kids have tutoring at nine, so I have to hit it early. And I went to a garage sale, first one of the day. Good morning, Barbara. And I took some pictures. I'll have to, to drop some pictures in. Um, there was this bush. I thought it was a bush. <laughs> and so I'm pulling up. I'm paying attention to the garage sale. There's a bush on my right side. Good morning, Twyla. Um, and, and then I hear this crunch. <laughs> the bush was like the mask. It was like a costume that the mailbox was wearing. And my side view mirror hit the mailbox and knocked it loose. Um, yeah, so I went over to check on it and you know, it was so loose that I had just picked it up and put it on the grass next to the, but I'm thinking I'm going slow. I'm going five miles an hour. Maybe this thing must've been loose already. This is my, and it's wearing a costume. Who does that to their mailbox is what I want to know. So anyway, then I have this dilemma. It's like 7:30 in the morning. What, right? Who puts a costume on their mailbox? Now, a lot of people. I saw a fish one the other day. So anyway, I have this dilemma. It's 7.30 in the morning. I'm an honest person. Do I go knock on their door at 7.30 in the morning? Good morning. How are you? <laughs> so what I did was I wrote them a note and just said, hey, you know, it's 7.30 in the morning. I really didn't want to come and like wake you up and tell you that I knocked off your mailbox. And I gave them my Google number because I have a Google voice number. And um, so, yeah, we'll see. I don't think I'm going to have to pay for it because it was a bush. <laughs> and I know this because my dad, he lives on the corner of this very busy, not super busy street, but people like to drive through his yard. And so he planted these rose bushes and put these stakes all through there to like hold up the rose bushes. And like the cops were still telling him if somebody damages their car driving through those stakes, you're liable, you know, because they didn't see the stakes and I'm like, it's his yard. What? So I'm wondering, I'll pay for it if I have to pay for it. But I, I think I'm being honest. So hopefully <laughs> they'll just be like, okay. I mean, it's not damaged. They could just hammer it back in. You know, I took pictures and I put on there. I took some pictures, you know, just to let you know. We'll see. We'll see. I did find a game though. <laughs> it was at the garage sale. It's not going for much, but maybe someday it will. Here we go. It's a Trump game. And it's really good condition. The outside, ugh, there we go. The outside looks good. And then the inside, all the pieces are still like new and sealed. So nobody ever played it. They just like unwrap the cellophane it looks like. So yeah, that's what I got. Picked that up for $2. And like I said, it's, I mean, new on Amazon, it's going for 50, but the outside is not sealed in cellophane, even though the inside is. I don't know. I don't know if that counts as new, but we'll see. We'll see. Um, and that's it for now. I'm going to go try to hit another garage sale because I have like 35 minutes now because I keep looking right I usually have my camera over here sorry um yeah yeah okay so I'll let you know what happens with the mailbox and I asked garage sale people like do you know them are they like generally normal people oh thanks D-Bay thanks Cheryl <laughs> no I so I and I told the garage sale guy no more adventures for today. That's it. I'm good. I won't. I won't. Who puts a costume on their mailbox, right? <laughs> a bush one. Okay. A bush one. Okay. Here I go. See you later. Okay. Well, I'm leaving this garage sale. There are some nuts out today. There's the heat. Maybe it's the heat. Hang on. Let me switch hands. I think the heat's making everybody crazy, y'all. So I'm leaving a garage sale. Hey, Harley woman, how's it going? Hey, Twyla. This man and this other lady literally just almost got into a fight over a dog carrier. Dog carrier. Hello, wait, I can't see. It's too bright. Hello, Harley woman. Yeah, they were, oh, let me get in the car. Let me get in the car. 
Yeah, I'm thinking maybe I ought to just get some gas and go home. <laughs> I was trying not to make eye contact. But they were like bringing everybody in the garage sale, like to onto their, trying to get them on their side. Didn't you see me walking around with this pet carrier? I put it down for two seconds and he picks it up. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah. So this guy, <laughs> they're out there. Watch out, Barbara. The heat, the heat's making people crazy. And the lady's still over there talking to the lady running the garage sale. So they, apparently she had picked up this dog crate carrier thing <laughs> and then she set it down while she was looking at something else and this dude picked it up and carried it over there and bought it and another dog carrier but I guess he got so wrapped up in their argument that he walked off and left the, the other one that he paid for <laughs> um so yeah and then so she starts freaking out that the guy picked up the dog carrier that she wanted to buy I mean they were having a screaming fight in the middle of this garage sale over this dog carrier. And the guy's like, sorry lady, you're not gonna be able to resell this one. Sorry lady, and he just kept repeating that. This is gonna be one resale you don't get. <laughs> I'm just like, what the? <laughs> you know, and she's like, gosh, she's this Hispanic lady. She's like, God bless you, God bless you, have a good day, have a good day. You know, <laughs> and it was crazy. And he was the one taking this stuff, and he was like, I already bought them, I already bought both of them. Cause the lady was asking, well, there's another dog crate over there, can I buy that one? Both mine, both mine. You can't resell these ones, lady. <laughs> but I guess he got so hyped up that he and his wife went and got in their truck with their one dog crate and they let the other one still sitting there and they drove off. <laughs> and so the other, the lady, the God bless you lady is still over there talking to the lady running the garage sale. I should leave now. Yeah, yeah, I should go. <laughs> it was, yeah, that was kind of nuts. That was kind of nuts. Okay, hey Greg, you missed the crazy story. And it wasn't me being crazy this time, surprise. Okay, I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna go. Oh, thanks for inviting followers. So yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go get some gasoline and go maybe hit one more garage sale and then gotta get my kids to tutoring. Yes, yes, it was a crazy story. I wish I had whipped my phone out, but I was just in such shock. I was in a lot of shock that I couldn't believe they were I mean, it went on. It went on. This fight that, between this lady and this dude. It was kind of nuts. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> First thing I do, I hit a mailbox. Second thing I do, witness a big old fight. What's going to happen at the next garage sale? But it's already like 85 degrees right now. It's 8 o'clock in the morning, so it's hot already. It's going to be a hot one. All right. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for coming in. I'll, uh, yeah, I'm sure I'll get back at you in a minute. I keep looking the wrong way. Sorry, you guys. Oh, the light's funky. There we go. Hey, guys. How's it going? How are you guys doing? I am just jumping in. I look orange. Is it just me? Maybe it's the shirt and the light. I'm like orange now. I guess it's a change though, right? It's not white. I'm usually just white. Um, but hey, how's it going, everybody? I am just popping in to say hello. Hello, Cashy Castaway. Um, hey, Franklin, what's going on, man? So yeah, I just got done. Hey, Shelly, how's it going? Oh, okay, it's a different name, I think, is what it is. <laughs> that I'm used to seeing. I don't know, maybe. I just went to the post office. Yes, I dropped off some packages. Uh, I had my store on vacation mode. Hey, Corduroy Fox. My store was on vacation mode for a while, and I was planning on having it stick it out to the end of the month until I got all of my, get everything back on track. Like the plan was to go through my workroom and like gut it and like like really clear things out and get that space workable. I put up a video a while back, I've been kind of talking about it. And I'm gonna share as I go along getting this room put up, put together, put back together and kind of refocus everything. But I was starting to panic. I mean, the like my bank account was like, dwindling and uh, so yeah I started to panic so I I turned my account back on yesterday and threw a sale up and so I've had four sales already whoo so that makes me feel a little better so I took the packages today to the post office ah that's a little better so anyway <laughs> did you see that room oh my gosh hey Maggie how are you I was I was and I was really like looking at my bank and just like oh my gosh what am I gonna do because I'm you know I still spend money especially with the kids home 
So yeah, that's the plan now. I'm I'm still working on the room. I worked on it for about an hour today, my workroom. I'm refocusing. Is it Barbara? <gasps> I'm refocusing. So I'm going through and pulling out things that I am not planning on listing or haven't listed yet and kind of just trying to like laser beam focus a little bit better on what I'm going to be doing. And y'all, I'm telling you, I was starting to get depressed, which is for me rough. When it, when it hits, it's bad. And so I think because we've been gone for a week and a half, we came home for like a day and then boom, I was gone again with Tanya. And so I was out of my routine for over two weeks and then coming home and just trying to like get back in the routine and then there's no money in my bank account and then the kids are just the kids, you know, they're great. But you know what I mean? If you got kids home for the summer. So I just started feeling myself going going into the depression and so I gave myself yesterday off I didn't upload a video if you noticed um, but honestly it was, it was kind of worse that I took a day off because I can't stop like I'm one of those people that's got to constantly be doing stuff um, I hope I'm not frozen nobody's saying anything shoot me some hearts y'all let me know you're still there <laughs> yes oh there it is okay good 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 <laughs> When it goes blank like that and there's nobody talking and there's no hearts, I'm like, oh gosh, I'm probably frozen like like this and nobody can hear me. Um, <laughs> yes, that's cha-chings. I'm addicted to them. But anyway, so I kind of took the day off yesterday. It didn't go so well. It wasn't it wasn't easy for me. And uh, so anyway, I ended up making like a schedule for myself. So hopefully that'll that'll help me out. So yeah. And then tomorrow I am going to do some garage sales. I went to one today and I found a Trump. Hang on, I'll show you. I showed this morning. It's still in the car because my workroom's a mess. <laughs> I got this Trump game. Uh, I paid. Look, one side it says it's two dollars. The other side says it's one dollar. I bet you I paid two dollars. <laughs> garage sales around yours. And and the outside's not sealed up, Franklin. Right? Score. But the inside pieces are, so I'm wondering, like, can I still sell it as new? It's not, like, shrink-wrapped, but the pieces and everything inside are still, like, all sealed and shrink-wrapped, like new. Because the new, it's going for 50 bucks on FBA. So used, like, new, maybe. So, did you? I love garlic. Oh, my gosh. Did I tell you, Maggie? The last time I had garlic, I, like, I, I made myself sick on it. I love it so much, and I just, like, an addict, and I didn't know when to stop. Or new on eBay yeah that's a good idea Franklin so there's we have a place called mod pizza here and it's kind of like a subway and you can like you they make your pizza there and you like get all the stuff on the pizza that you want and like they have crushed garlic and they have roasted garlic and they have garlic sauce and like oh my gosh I OD'd on garlic I'm not even joking I was smelling how did this turn into garlic <laughs> Oh my gosh, I had so much garlic on my pizza. Like I couldn't, even after I showered and everything and like the next day too, I was like, I could still smell it. I could still taste it in my mouth. I, oh yeah, I was telling Randy, I OG'd. If you've seen, there's a movie called I'm Gonna Get You Sucker," and the guy OG's cause he's wearing too much gold. And I was like, I OG'd cause I ate too much garlic. <laughs> it was, I've never had that happen before from eating garlic, but I ate a lot, yeah. Uh, oh gee okay <laughs> alrighty oh no no vampires no vampires <laughs> the sparkly ones or the true blood ones can I choose okay all right I'm gonna go in uh, we're going out to dinner tonight to get some Mexican Tex-Mex I should say some Tex-Mex and I'm sure I'll pop in again tomorrow they say that the smell of garlic yes yes it does it does like you can smell it you know or if you work out after you can, you can smell it when you're sweating I oh, do oh, yeah yeah <laughs> but I love it I can't help it I haven't seen that yet Barbara Pride and Prejudice and Zombies I need to I need to I, I hear I'm a Jane Austen fan so I was kind of like do I read the book do I watch them is it one of those that you have to read the book before you watch the movie or is it that's what attracted me to yeah Right, right. I did. I worked out today. That was something else I did. Well, sort of worked out. I got on the elliptical for 20 minutes. That's why. That's another thing I'm trying to do. Is like, when you start seeing yourself on video, like you guys see me from like the shoulders up. But then when I I'm watching like Steve Rakin's videos or Bonafides, and I'm like seeing myself, like, whoa. 
<laughs> Let's just, I got 12 months to get this in check before next year. <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, Snoog Life, how's it going? So yeah, I am going to, yeah, I'm trying to get this fixed. And then, and then another thing on top of that, like I went out with my girlfriends from college and I was like not wanting to go. I'm going to be talking about this more on Sunday, but I, I didn't want to go because I was like, oh, thinking they were going to judge me because I put on a lot of weight. So, but yeah, I'm going to talk about it on Sunday while we're here, while I'm telling you here. So yeah, Sunday, I'm going to do like a chat about other stuff like updates and health and like trying to get everything back on track in my life and hopefully that it will help somebody. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go do some garage sales in the morning and I'm sure I'll have some more to show you and I'm going to do a haul tomorrow. That's what else. Uh, what else was I going to tell you? I'm going to do a live haul tomorrow. My boxes came in from California from our trip. And so I'm going to unbox the two boxes uh, in a live haul tomorrow. Oh gosh, I, maybe I had to put that up so people will know it's coming. <laughs> All right, I'm going to make a link when I get inside. Good gosh. See, I'm going to go inside, make a link for this video that I'm going to do tomorrow, live haul of the stuff I got from our trip. Yeah. Okay. I, but the, the jewelry ones, I will show like the jewelry, but I'm not going to unbag those. That's going to be separate because that's going to take some time. Um, yeah. So yay. Okay. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, I will. I will. We're going to go have dinner with some other friends and I will see you guys later. And I'm remind me, Barbara, you can start texting me like when I get off. Don't forget by the time I get to the house, the door, I promise I will have forgotten that I'm going to go in there and make the link for the video because I'm at like scatterbrain sometimes. Okay, for real. Bye. And you're all like, bye. Okay, enough. Bye. Bye.